let's see. I was, um, I, you know, as you know, uh, the last couple of days, um, Marvel did a really, they parodied themselves and created two joke characters that nobody likes. As you know, Snowflake and uh, Safe Space. All right. And I po posted already about it, a couple more things. But here's my take on it, because I found it very strange that they would create these weirdo, weirdo characters that nobody wanted, nobody wants, and nobody likes. So what I did was I did a like a like like a, um, I, I took some time. It took me about 45 minutes to create a character, a joke character, a really racist joke character that Marvel could do. Right. And uh, and in the end, because I'm not going to blame and go right about anybody else in this way. Because I'm an Indian, so I will do a joke character about my my own ethnicity, and here's what I did. So, so I put on it at Marvel. Since Marvel seems to need new characters, here's my take: the Curry Muncher, Indian male, well wears a Gandhi cap. Now the Gandhi cap is a white little uh, little you know like it folds up into this little kind of like that shape. Yeah, it's almost like a upside down W without the bit in the middle. Okay. And he wears a dhoti. A dhoti is like a, uh, a wrap around robe. Okay. Chappal, which is sandals, right? It was a leather sandals. Uh, so your feet, uh, toes are exposed. And he uses a chappal, to, um, the sandal, to ward off attacks as its soul is made as a strong as an adamantian. So he could basically take his shoes off and wave it around like sandals of wave around and you know hit off like like uh let's say uh, cyclops uh laser beams right and so on or captain marvel's um you know whatever she does with her hands i mean our characters do that with their hands as well one of them um uh, but also you know the zapping thing whatever Hurricane, that sort of thing right uh so super strong from years of plowing the rice and tea fields, right? His cap is to cover his um, his super smart brain, right? Because I want to get that. I want to show that hey, Indians are smart, all right? Because this is where they're going at. They're going for the whole sciencey smarty thing, which is also his weak spot, all right? So he's right. So he's got to make sure he's got he's got a, he's got a little uh, kryptonite. His brain, even though he's very super smart, his brain is kryptonite as well. So you can, you know, you gotta, if you hit him in the head or something, I guess, it'll get weak. He is naturally skinny, so his strength is not obvious, right? Uh, so he's strong, but he's skinny as well. So you, you can't tell he's that strong. So he could probably take on Hulk and so on, if you, if you really want it. He's also very light skinned because you see, that's the current theme of black characters and ethnic characters in uh, in mainstream media now, is that you can't be a dark-skinned, really, really dark-skinned character on TV and uh, unless you're a really, really huge name, right? Uh, or, and hey, I could be, you know, I'm going to take that with a grain of salt. I could be wrong with that, but I, I do see a lot of light-skinned uh, characters on TV uh, and you see that in Doctor Who right uh when they uh, sorry not dr picard right uh one of the right and here's the reason i say that is because the weird thing is that they introduce a black female character in picard who's a junkie so their way to show put a black character in a show of picard star trek picard was to put a black character female druggy so yeah they didn't even see the racism in that when they did that um you know because all about like hey a powerful woman and stuff and all that which i have no problem with as you know because i'm creating a powerful woman as a character all right i've got a couple actually <laughs> it's about three uh was it four of them i think was introduced straight away in the first issue uh yeah so right back so he's not right his energy comes from eating spicy food, right? Which also gives him, which also 
gives a means, uh, which also means his teammates in the new New Avengers, because I want him to join the new New Avengers, right? Give that, give that, uh, uh, give that team a ethnic, you know, the ethnic uh, touch, addition by putting an Indian there. So, uh, right. So, which means, also, which also means his uh, his teammates in New New Avengers don't like being near him when he's fighting because obviously the spicy food's making comes out of him. His pores makes him smelly. All right. I'm really going for the hard hard knocks here. Remember, this is a joke character, a joke character, guys. This is me joking, just in case you're not thinking about how I how I feel about what where Marvel is going and with this whole situation with their new characters. All right, but that's okay because he's used to it being from the Untouchables cast, right? We're gonna make him from the lowest cast. Right, because that's the other thing that they go on. It's like they try to um um they try to go. Let's go. What's let's get our characters characters from the the worst situations in their life so we can make them that. I have no problem with that, but they seem to be going way too far. Right, able to move great distances using his daughter. Remember, I was saying how. Ah, uh, hey, sorry, Mike. Yeah, cheers, bro. Um, yeah, it's all good. Uh, okay, so yeah, uh, my guest is just saying that um, he's not able to make it. Um, all right, so back to this joke character, though, a superhero that I'm creating, Indian superhero character. All right, so remember how I was talking about the doji, the wraparound um, that you know Indian um, elderly gentlemen mostly wear now. Uh, I think they still do. Um, I remember. Um, my granddad used to wear them at um, at festival times, like ritual times. Um, I've never worn them that I can remember of as a kid. Um, okay, so right, so able to gr move great distances using his dhoti, which is able to extend two hundred meters, as it's made from a special material, right? So he can basically by whistling, right makes it extend and he's able to run across it like Iceman. So he's able to go, whoosh, you know, I can't whistle, sorry guys. You know, he whistles and the, his clothing comes off and it forms into, depending on how he whistles, whichever direction he wants to go in and how hard he wants it to be. So he can run across on it. Remember, he's very strong and he's, you know, I guess he's fast as well now because, well, he doesn't have to be fast. He can just run across to where he needs to go. Right, because he's not flying, he's not able to fly, so we got to give him something else. We can't make everybody fly, all right. You got to have some different characters here, so um, right by whistling, right by like Iceman with um, you know, with ice. So, ice, Iceman can just basically do a little arc and get, get across it on there, and even send his friends across it, uh, like a slide, right. Now, whist here we go. Whistling has its background to his father being a snake charmer, right? I'm really going for the hard knocks here, guys. This is me really bringing out the hard, hard, hard jokes here. Well, parody of this thing, right? Uh, Whistling has its background to his father being a snake charmer, right? Really going for the Indian thing here. Here we show how terrible his father was to the family, and that let's call him Ramesh, right? This character is called Ramesh because, hey, why not? Uh, ran away to join other similar power teams like him. So that's how he joins up the new, new Avengers, right? Now, if C.B. Sobolski, right, the guy who's running uh, um, and making all these, seriously, he's making all these joke characters happen in Marvel, likes, he can find an angry, white-hating white hate, white female writer to pour all the energy into making this the basis of an in, of an Indian mutant team archetype of all that is what can be the brand new capital letters brand new Indian mutant comic book character at the capitals brave and new 2020 Marvel right uh, I know it seems strange that I would just put this all together in 45 minutes I saw how long it took I think it might have taken a little less I did create a character just like that. 45 minutes. It took me. 
to create this joke, parody, comedy, racist character, right? Totally overboard character in less than 45 minutes. When it, the reason I mentioned this, when it probably took the new, new Warriors characters to create a month, right, to come up with, oh, now I can't remember, uh, safe space, all right? Um, let me just go to Marvel so I get it right, all right? Uh, Marvel.com, because it's on their website, guys. This is, this is how great, uh, this is where Marvel's heading and trying to kill the industry. Their, sorry, their own company. And already we know the mainstream mediums, uh, mainstream um, comic books is on the way out. 